romance was not a theme I was expecting from this show. I was going into this just to dunk on these dumbass Otome game princes, these dumb idiot NPCs, and for the power fantasy, for Yumila to flex on them. But turns out, Patrico finally shows up and he is patrizzing Yumilia in a non-forced way because everybody obviously discriminates against her for having dark magic that's associated with black hair. Everyone's thinking that she could be the demon lord because of some cap that the prince and the Alicia. Anyways, they're racist. Yes, I understand what prejudice is, but they're racist. But Patrick, sorry, Patrico, he doesn't care about that because he himself understands that discrimination. And by being able to relate to that and accept her she's just like oh oh shit i'm blushing so the romance is not forced at all it's quite genuine i wonder how this will build up in the coming episodes let's see what's gonna happen today cgi cgi npcs cgi horse cgi cgi cg this guy's reused this is the reuse scene 100 i remember this green ass car with this blonde go team motherfucker right here no 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 and if you look in the behind the scenes look at this guy running this guy over here the purple dude this dude? Oh yeah, you know what I'm talking about. The tip? Okay. Just the tip? Oh Jesus. You know what? He's doing better though compared- Never mind. Now I've got to heal him. And he gets disgusted by the healing. Actually, he said it feels good now, right? Well, he says he's getting used to it. I'm not sure if that's a good thing. He doesn't like become stronger though, right? When he train- Well, techniques and stuff, I'm sure it'll be refined, but like... He doesn't level up from this training, right? Because you have to kill monsters, right? Oh yeah, the, the bending slab. The thing that we broke last time. <laughs> we did it last time too, and the principal was like, what the fuck? You can't do it. Lately what? Oh my god, not her again. Never mind, I thought it was Alicia. They're asking her for help now? What? Wait, our reputation is getting better. I thought they'd be terrified of us. I think it's because of Patrick. Maybe it's because of Patrick. Are you dating? Oh, you don't want to know. <laughs> You're trying to break a metal slab. She has like... She's, she's such a gamer. That's the only thing she can even think about, huh? Like... There was no hesitation there, just leveling up. She didn't even think about, like, oh, do they think that we're dating? I'll blow the whistle for you. That's right. Because she's a gamer. She really only cares about leveling up. Oh. A beast tamer and a wild beast? Who is the beast tamer and who is the wild beast here? Who the fuck said that? Who the fuck said that? They're shit talking us, dude. They're shit talking us. Oh my god. Not her! She sucks! Boo! Yeah, you're alone, bitch. Just like us. No! No! Get good, bitch! Go to the dungeon by herself. Yumila is too good of a person. She's way too good, dude. I'll oh, slap this girl right now. You falling for it? Did she just fall for the hero in smile? Simping? For Alicia right here? What is this? This chibi moment with the bubbles in the background. Doesn't, and she's kind of blushing, not really. There's a faint, just a tiny bit of blush here. Does this mean that she actually accepts her? No, 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 blush. There's a blush right there. It's very, very faint, it's, but it's right below here. I don't like this bubbly background because this implies that Alicia, you know, Yumila kind of like cares about Alicia. Ugh. Just straight up think of a finishing move. That's the first thing. She doesn't even know how to use it properly and you want a finishing move. Strong memories. Fuck your grandma back in the country. No, I don't feel bad. Don't care. Country bumpkin? Then again, we're a country bumpkin too. I mean, I'm, I'm, just, I'm just being unreasonable now. <laughs> She's sharing her sentimental story and I'm just shitting on her grandma. What did the grandma do, dude? Nothing. <laughs> she raised an evil demon, that's what she did. Yeah, but the grandma races too, man. Boo! Never come back! Boo! Hope you trip on the way out. Uh, who is this? Patrick. Patrico! 
Oh, really? It's not from you? Keiki! Keiki! Do you want to eat them with me in my room? And, and you know that Yumiya is probably not even thinking about like romance right now, right? She's just saying this shit to be nice. Look at the look look at how look how taken back Patrick was. He's like, oh my god. Are, are, are we doing this? Take him back in a good way, like he's shocked. <laughs> I like Rita. Rita's nice. <clears throat> look at him blushing. Look at him blushing. <laughs> how dare you invite me to your room? Uh, I'm sorry. Let's go. No, let's eat in the dorm with the maid. Umai? Umai no. Nande Yumiera ga tokuige nanda? Yeah, it's not even yours. Wait, our fans. These two girls again. We got fans. Martial arts competition. New arc tournament arc? Wait. Hold up, Bushin Festival? Monday man, are you here? It, it wouldn't be fair though, right? It's level 99. Right, so the winners get an amulet that enhances dark magic. The gaming instinct of Yumila is gonna make her enter that. Mm. Why would they give such a prize though? No one can use dark magic except Yumila. Who even decided this prize? What the fuck? Yeah, yeah she does. Yes! Limited event! Limited event, let's go! Something about this is suspicious though, huh? How the reward is specifically for Yumila? This dude probably has something to do with it. Now look at this cunning bastard. Hmm, I don't like this guy at all. You're scaring me, bro. <laughs> so he took the fucking... He, he, he's baiting right now, but... So does the amulet even exist? If it doesn't, then he just wants her to just flex on the people? Like, does... Like, does he even have such an amulet? I feel like he doesn't. All right, here we go. Martial arts competition. Yo, that's crazy. This is so crazy. Look at this. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Eight blue hair dudes. And the laziest part is right over here. You're telling me that this is a fucking triplet? Just all over here? Yeah, they're all... Like, you're not even trying. Like, you have blue hair dudes. Six of these dudes. Two green hair dudes. Two blonde. At least this green hair girl is at least normal. And then the rest of the audience above are just fucking random blots. Just little spots. But, like, that's crazy. That's crazy. You could have tried to use any other color. But you use six blue hair dudes. Holy shit. <laughs> Flexing Yumila to the nobles. To make them feel confident in our power. <laughs> that was a sassy chibi moment. That was like, oh, so popular. Look at this. This is cheeky. Very cheeky chibi moment right here. Yeah, very popular. Oh, the princess. Where are the princess at, man? She doesn't need good luck. She, yeah, we should be saying good luck to everyone else. They're gonna get slapped once with the sword and they're gonna die. Look at these dumbass princes, dude. Look at these dumbasses. <laughs> so basically, <laughs> we gotta take out all the people on the left, and everyone on the right side got away. They're like, oh, thank God, I didn't make it in my bracket. <laughs> yeah, we trained. Okay, so did we. <laughs> You're right. <laughs> Level 20, but dude, do you not know math? Do you like what do you mean she's 99? <laughs> she really, all right, I achieved that by the age of like five, but okay. Why are you so proud? Look how proud he is. I see, that's crazy. Wild. <laughs> the fucking Eleonore NPC lines. Remember, remember, we have our hotkeys ready to go for the NPC dialogue lines. Wow, that's crazy, bro. That's insane. Our three lines. Did it work? He took offense to that. No! No, no don't apologize. No, no, I need these princes to be fucking shitty. Or I can't have beef with them. I don't want redemption for these princes. Okay. We already surpassed them. But like... So, so you understand that she's level 99. And that you're level 20. 
but like, and you understand that you meal a beat at all, and now you're still like, yeah, I can do it. Like, that is a level of confidence or stupidity I can't even comprehend. <laughs> you are a girl to your death. <laughs> what do you? I don't understand how he's thinking. Like, whoa. Wow, Miles Clory, who are you? All right, here we go. Dorkness versus Lewis. Lewis Lexum. All right, Lewis, what do you got? That was Adolf in the stand, right? Okay, we're gonna let him shine. Bro, she's straight up just smurfing and trying to make him look good. Important rule here, okay. A broken weapon is instant disqualification. So I guess that's one way we could lose. Like, already you can imagine a cliche of like, Yumila was trying to flex or something. And like, the sword breaks from her power. The sword could not handle the burden of whatever power she was trying to unleash, right? We could see something like that. Wait, is this sword good? Yeah, look at that. She just snaps it. Oh my gosh, she's just swinging it. That's like a tornado. Bro fucking saw his life flash. <laughs> as soon as she started swinging the sword, bro was like, no. 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 She level 99. I'm out. I'm out. <laughs> okay. And Yumila wins. Yumila wins. Woo! No, you scared him. You terrified him with that swing. Oh, okay. We're just speedrunning this arc. Right, everybody fucking surrender. She gets to the finals. Who made it to the finals? Uh, Edwin or... Red Her Dude? Damn, his swords got bigger. Oh! What? He beat the crown prince? Second, second crown... William Aris! That's a big dub for William, man. It looks pretty bad for the second crown prince, huh? Like, y y I, I wonder if there's ever going to be, like, drama or some kind of friction between these two now. Because, like, there's such... I don't know. I, I'd imagine Edwin's such a petty piece of shit, you know? Wow. Okay, okay. This is just swords. And he doesn't... Okay, this is actually good sportsmanship. No magic involved, just swords. So it makes sense. Okay, gotcha. Here we go. Sure. Please, we haven't fought some single person yet. She made it to the finals without fighting. Wow. Wow, the great sword of Strodo. Let's break it. So he has an endgame sword. Let's snap it in half. How did he get it? Rich parents. <laughs> She's dodging so casually. Bro, come on! You're too slow! Great swords are pretty heavy, though. Yeah, because you can't hit us. Fucking hit us, then. Yes! Make it hype! Come on! Put on a performance! What's it gonna do? Oh, oh, oh! Wait, the sword's kind of breaking, though. Wait! What are you- Whoa, 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 She just one-punched it! She fucking wanna punch that shit! No one saw that, right? No one saw that, right? You meal a punch! No one saw that, right? Okay, it's super fast, no one saw that. That was like frame one. We just went like, boom! Maybe Adolf saw it. I bet Adolf saw it. The referee didn't see it. Adolf definitely saw it. I'm looking for a re <laughs> Look how smug she looks. My hand kind of moved on its own accord. You meal a punch. I hope she has other techniques later. You meal a knee. Okay, see? Adolf saw it. Ooh, magic portion. Man, I, I wanted like, you know, 1v1 combat to like the death of like two magicians going at it. But I guess in, the, in this part of the competition, you just do... Look at my fancy power, like, you know, fucking magic tricks, like, wow, 20 out of 20, stuff like that. Oh my god. Oh, you suck! I hate you! Cry! <laughs> you suck! Fucking swipe daddy's credit card. What did you do then? The right way? You mean the fucking inefficient way? 
Okay, they're all admitting that we are 99. No! No, no, no redemption. No redemption. Fuck this apology. I'm a petty motherfucker. I need someone to beef with when I'm watching these kind of shows, okay? No, I don't accept this apology. You mean like him, though. Good, good, good. I hate you too. I fucking hate you. So he apologizes and he literally says, I still don't like you. Boo. Boo, I'm not sorry. I'm not sorry. You suck. No, you're not. You're not. You're monologuing too much. Nope. Nope. Oh, wait, she's going full strength this time? Nah, this guy still sucks, dude. Oh, God, here we go. Are you all ready? Remember the last time this girl was fucking using her light magic on that little armor straw thing? And everyone's like, oh, my God, you're so amazing. Look at everyone glaze this bitch up now, too. Let's see it. All right. All right. What do you got? <laughs> Think about my memories with my grandma back at home. Fuck you. And your racist grandma. Sun Ray? More like pussy rain. I don't know. Oh, little, little bitch ass magic making these kids happy. I don't care. These kids can cry. No. Fuck your racist grandma, too. Don't care. No. Not a happy moment. No. She's not a heroine. She's a clansman. Boo. Boo. Okay, see the rarity. Rarity determines some of the point system. So exactly. We could. So if we just drop a black hole, though, I don't think they'll be too happy. Oh, this guy again. Boo! Look at these party tricks. Oh, he actually scored higher than Alicia. Oh, this guy. Look at Megane, dude. Let's look at Megane. He thinks he's so cool right now. Nope. You suck. CGI cube! You summoned the CGI cube! You suck! More CGI cubes! Oh my god, the power of computer graphic images! Lame. Lame. Nope. Don't care. Don't care. Lame. No, you're not supposed to admit that he's a genius. No! Ugh. I mean, compared to everyone else, I can only use a single element. Like, I guess he is. Boo! Holy shit, that's a perfect hundred. That's a perfect hundred. We're gonna need to go beyond or tie. What the fuck? Oh, shit. We can tie it. Or maybe we can go beyond that. I don't want to draw, though. Do we go to overtime if there's a draw? Black hole. Let's go, darkness. Black hole. Oh, Patrick's watching. Patrick's watching. Because he's terrified of you. He's probably terrified of you. He's straight up probably the furthest back because he knows that some shit's about to go down. He doesn't want to get caught up in the front lines. Oh, she's a little sad about that. What do you mean you're gonna do your best so you can see from there? I don't think that's what he wants. I think she's about to go all out even more now because he's sitting even further back. Oh no. Oh no. <laughs> she's determined even more, dude. Uh oh. Ah, <laughs> see, Patrick realized. Patrick realized immediately. Then you could argue, oh, I hate these princes, but you could argue that even without verbal communication, Patrick understood based on Emilia's actions because they're connected, you know? How else would he understand? So they're connected. That's a ship. Uh-oh. What's he gonna do? Display of power again. Here we go. What's he gonna summon this time? Black hole again? Last time! Yo, the entire village went to shit! Alright, well, one more black hole. Patrick is like, fuck! What about everyone else, though? So this is actual full strength black hole compared to last time. Okay. Did anyone get sucked in? Did anyone die? She probably thinks it's beautiful, but everyone else is probably fucking terrified right now, right? Like, she's like, oh my god, that was so cool! 
Did she swallow the clouds? Is that why the, the sky is so bright? Nah, she's using clouds. Wait. The fuck? Wait. That's a nice detail that we should have known. Oh, I forgot that this spell always causes a miniature typhoon. What the fuck? That was the kind of bad. Yeah. They think that we're the demon lord. That's right. Another black hole. Another black hole. Black hole to it. No, we're not done yet until I say so. Oh, God. Oh, God. 300? What? Triple? Did the referee just make this shit up? Because he's like, no, we can't afford to have people dying right now. No, no, just take the 300. Bro is not even the people showing what the 20 out of 20 like fucking scores. He's like, no, just take the 300. Okay. Okay. Hey, we... Somehow, okay. Oh, wait. The amulet actually does exist. Look at it. It's like glowing in dark. Maybe it's bullshit, though. Maybe it's bullshit. I don't know. Is it really? Okay, I guess it is the real deal. <laughs> she doesn't. <laughs> Look at her. <laughs> no, chill. Chill. Chill the fuck out. What do you mean? <laughs> you know what? I think like, um, she doesn't need it, right? Because straight up. This is like math. You know, when you reach a number infinity, no matter how much you, like if you two times infinity, it is still infinity, you know? Cause like when you're at this like upper limit, you really don't need any more. It's just like meaningless. But that is the episode, bro. It is pretty fun episode, huh? Didn't expect a short tournament arc out of nowhere. We had two phases too, right? We had like a Bushin festival, just sword, where we defeated William. Can't even say we defeated Williams. We fucking snapped this sword in half with their bare hands. And <laughs> little fucking little light magic. Look, look at this little bitch. Oh my god. Alicia's little light magic with the racist grandma. I don't care. I don't care about their fucking soft little memories back in the countryside. I hate this girl. I'll continue hating her. I'm the biggest hater right now. Fucking Oswald's, you know, multi element CGI. I don't give a shit. Fuck your cubes. But the black hole, that's right. 300. Three times what Oswald got. Because that's how more... I think we should have gotten more, dude. We should have gotten fucking 999. You know what? They should have just gave us 999. Wouldn't that be inappropriate for this kind of show, right? But that's it from me. If you're still here, if you didn't enjoy this reaction, please like the video. Check out the other playlist for more content. And until next time, take care.